If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. To print or save checks in QuickBooks Online, click the plus new button in the navigation bar, and then click the print checks link under the vendors heading in the menu that appears. The first time you try to print a check in QuickBooks Online, the print checks setup window appears. This window asks what type of checks you use, like voucher or standard. You then print a sample check on blank paper to ensure the fields print properly on the check. If finished and satisfied with the results, click the Yes, I'm finished with setup button to open the print checks page. If the checks fields are not properly aligned, instead click the No Continue Setup button to move to the next step in the setup. This lets you download the most recent version of Adobe Acrobat Reader. If you already have the most recent version, click the No Continue Setup button to go to the next step. The final step to ensure your checks print properly is the Adjust Alignment step. This step lets you drag a grid on screen to adjust where QuickBooks Online prints the check to ensure the proper check alignment. After making the adjustments and confirming all the fields are properly aligned, click the Finish Setup button to close the setup window and open the Print Checks window. In the future, when you try to print a check, you immediately open the Print Checks window. If you need to change your check setup later, you can click the Print Setup button in the toolbar at the bottom of this window to go through the Print Check Setup wizard again. The Print Checks window shows a list of any checks you have created but not printed. To select the account that has checks waiting to print, use the Account dropdown in the upper left corner of the window. The account's balance appears to the right. To create a new check from this window if needed, click the Create Check button in the upper right corner to open a new check window. To filter the list of checks by transaction type, select a choice from the Transaction Type dropdown. To change the sort order of the checks, select a choice from the Sort By dropdown. Enter the starting check number of the checks to print into the Starting Check Number field. To select the checks to print in the list of saved checks, check the checkbox to the left of the checks. A black box then appears above the list, showing the total number of checks selected to print, followed by the total amount of the selected checks. To remove the selected checks from the list if needed, click the Remove button in the black box above the list to open a confirmation pop-up window. In this window, click the No button to cancel the check removal and return to the Print Checks page. Alternatively, click the Yes button to remove the selected checks from the list. You must then individually print those checks. In the upper right corner of the checklist are the Export to Excel, Print, and Settings buttons. To download the list of checks as an Excel workbook, click the Export to Excel button. To open your web browser's print dialog box and preview the list of checks, click the Print button. To show the list's display options in a drop-down menu, click the Settings button. To show or hide columns in the list, check or uncheck the column names under the column's heading in the drop-down menu. To select the number of rows to show per page in the list, click the Rows drop-down in the drop-down menu and select a choice. The toolbar at the bottom of the page contains Cancel, Print Setup, Order Checks, and Preview and Print buttons. To cancel printing checks, click the Cancel button. To configure checks for printing again, click the Print Setup button. To order checks online from Intuit, click the Order Checks button. After entering a starting check number, to then open a PDF print preview of the selected checks where you can click a print button to print them or click a download button to download them, 
click the Preview and Print button. You can click the Close button in the window after printing or downloading the checks. After printing the checks, a pop-up window appears and asks, did your checks print OK? If they printed correctly, select the Yes, they all printed correctly option. If you need to reprint some checks, select the Some checks need reprinting, starting with Check option, and then use the adjacent drop-down to select the starting check number of the checks that need reprinting. If none of the checks printed correctly, Select the No Keep All Checks in the Print Checks List option. After selecting an option, click the Done button to close the page and continue with the check printing option you selected, if any. Remember to click the Subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www dot teachyoucomp dot com